the end of the road. Let's just take a little while longer to admire the awesomeness of that sky. Ah, <sighs> yep. Well, this is it. This is the water line, or the uh, thing that holds the water, and I guess it just goes into there. That um, it waters the plants and all that. So I wonder what would happen. Not thirsty. That's not what I'm saying, not thirsty. <laughs> Yeah, we shot a barrel of water. Cool. Yeah, listen to that noise. Uh oh. That doesn't sound good. That doesn't sound good. <laughs> I'm going to size what it looks like. I can't leave until I know Hector is finished. What's he doing in there? He's just like... I don't know what he's doing, it's weird. Can you see him in there? No. <laughs> uh, I can't believe it, we're at the end of the road. Well, let's go see. Alright, get your gun ready, you don't know what's gonna happen. Dun, dun, dun. Oh! Oh yeah! Look at that! <laughs> He's finished. Cool. The number nine. Let's hope it doesn't turn into a hell demon this time. You can count them if you want. They're all here. How about yours? The company gave me one on the other end. Sort of a retirement present. And, uh, demons ride free, right? Aw, oh, man, you know I can't go with you. I'm a spirit of the land and all that. I can't ever leave this world. I guess I got so wrapped up in saving people, I just assume I'd be able to save you too. Yeah, but I don't need to be saved. I like it here. I'm not all alone in that basement anymore, thanks to you. I got a new job and all these new friends. I'm a big demon success story. So, I guess this is it then. Give me a, give me a hug. Oof. <laughs> you were the best boss I ever had. Bye. I mean, he's done. Yeah. Manny? Yeah? When we get to the next world... What is it, Angel? Are we going to be together? You know, sweetheart, if there's one thing I've learned, it's this. Nobody knows what's gonna happen at the end of the line. So you might as well enjoy the trip. And that was it. That is Grim Fandango. Poor Gladys stayed behind for some reason. I have no idea. But hey, uh, at least we made it to our destination. Oh man, I, I hope you guys could see in this Let's Play why I love this game so much. It's just awesome. So... Yeah, let's see, what can I say that I haven't already said about it? Music's awesome, gameplay's awesome, 
graphics just look awesome, writing is awesome, characters are awesome, everything is awesome. That's why this game is awesome. <laughs> Uh, well, I'm glad I at least got to let's play this game, because there would have been no way to let's play it without residual, um, so I thank them very much. Yeah, the first time I played this game, I was, I'm trying to think, I probably played it first in like 1998 or 99. No, yeah, probably like 99 I first played it, um, and I, I, I mean, I didn't know how to do the puzzles, obviously, I was just a little kid, but, man, I, I love this game so much. Uh, let's see. Oh, this music's awesome. <laughs> of course. Uh, so yeah, it's got a very strong tie to me my childhood and all that. So that's probably why I love it so much among other games. Um, but, mm, I still think it's awesome. I mean, I highly doubt anyone would say this is a bad game. Yeah, I mean, if anyone would ever say this is a bad game, they probably only play Call of Duty and don't like anything that has graphics that are pre-Xbox 360, because they're a bunch of freaking nutcases. But enough on that little rant about most, not most, I'll probably say a lot of Call of Duty fans, especially ones that are like 13. <sighs> no offense to anyone who's 13 and, play, and plays Call of Duty that likes this, I'm talking about the people that play Call of Duty who are 13 years old and hate games like this. So yeah. Why am I going off- my voice cracked. Why am I going off on a rant like this? I shouldn't be going off on a rant. It's the end of my- let's play my favorite game ever. Oh, man. Yeah, Rubicava is probably one of the best little places- well, the Blue Casket is probably one of the best little places ever in this whole game. It's just awesome. I'm trying to think of what I'm going to let's play next. I might do some humongous games, um, just- because I don't have any of my game consoles in my Dazzle. So that's going to be kind of hard to let's play some console stuff. Yeah. Just uh, any humongous games that I haven't let's played yet that you'd like to see let's play, just put in the comments and I'll consider it. Because, you know, I'd have to go through my videos. Oh, I've already let's played that. Or I could re-let's play that or whatever. No, I've already done all the Spy Fox games, so I can't do any of those. Even though I love Operation Ozone, I'd love to let's play again for some reason. <laughs> Special links to George Lucas. Yeah, I bet they're saying that now. Uh, George Lucas. Oh, George. And now it's a blank screen. Do we just wait for the music to stop? Does it just exit? Um, it appears to be a blank screen. Um, so, anyway guys, I guess that's it. Um, I really hope you enjoyed this Let's Play. It was amazing. I, I loved this Let's Play. I love this game. And, uh, yeah, I, I hope you guys uh, like it. Liked it and like the game too and want to go out and buy it and things like that because this game really is awesome so anyway guys this has been me Sky and Freeman saying so long thanks for watching please subscribe to my videos if you like them and yeah guys later <laughs>